Hello plant friends, Adina here from Plants Equals Happiness. In today's video I want to show you Hoya growth, Hoya flowers and a beautiful uh, plant that uh, I have in my uh, collection. And uh, to show you what is going on in my greenhouse. So let's just start it. First, I want to show you that my Hoya Nabawayensis flower for me. I mean, look at that beautiful, beautiful, beautiful flowers. I'm so happy that uh, this Hoya flower for me is the first time when she flowered. I will take her down. I mean, beautiful, beautiful Hoya. It looks like a little bit like Hoya sunrise. I mean, it's sun stress. Look how beautiful it is. I'm so happy. Nabawanensis, because it flower for me. I mean, the flower, it's absolutely gorgeous. I will put it back and show you in more depth. I have another cutting of this Hoya in case if something happened with the mother plant. I always do that because it's a, it, it's like I'm uh, ensured that is, if this uh, Hoya is going down the hill, I have a new Hoya uh, young plant in my collection. Beautiful, stunning. The second one that it's been in my collection for uh, two years now, Stephanotis. I mean, this is more like a jasmine a type of uh, plant. And I will show you how oh, the smell, it's absolutely gorgeous. And I will show you how beautiful this plant grew for me. And look at that, look at those flowers. Absolutely beautiful. And the smell in this greenhouse, it's absolutely, oh my God, breathtaking. Look, very, very beautiful. I mean, the Stephanotis, I think it's called uh, uh, Jasmine as well. I love, love, love the leaves, but I love the flowers as well. And I think it's going to flower more. As you can see, the buds, very beautiful, absolutely stunning. Oh, this Hoya has been in my collection for a number of years. Uh, Hoya species Vietnam APC 183 and so happy that it grew as you can see another leaf very very beautiful I just watered recently this one it grew this year as well I mean look at that how beautiful it is and this was the main um, leaf on the Hoya I mean I'm so happy that it grew this one absolutely stunning very very beautiful I think yeah I watered yesterday and look how beautiful it is I think it's going to grow more and I'm so happy about it I mean this way it's absolutely gorgeous look at the uh, main uh, leaf very beautiful love 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 this way so much and this year grew two new leaves, which makes me more happy. Another one that it's absolutely uh, beautiful and I absolutely love, love, love this Hoya. This is my Hoya Kodata. I mean, we all love Hoya Kodata. And we know why, because of these beautiful, beautiful leaves. And you can see the baby leaf. Absolutely love the speckle on the leaves as well. Absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful, beautiful Hoya to have in your collection. And I hope one day is going to flower for me as well because I cannot wait to see the flowers. I don't remember if I had in the past um, Hoya Kodata uh, flowers. I don't remember to be honest with you, but I always, always love, 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 love to see the flowers. This is my beautiful, uh, beautiful, beautiful cactus. 
gynecalcium stenopleurum is going to finish uh, blooming for me beautiful beautiful flowers absolutely gorgeous and my echeveria uh, raindrops flowered for me i mean look at that how beautiful the flowers are absolutely loving it it's say raindrops but i don't know i think it's a normal a regular uh, echeveria because doesn't have that rain uh, drop on the leaf but doesn't matter i i love uh, succulents and i love cactus as well so uh, to be honest with you i don't really mind if uh, they are normal or maybe with uh, variegation or with anything uh, they are all beautiful another Hoya that it's absolutely gorgeous and it grew this year for me this is my Hoya cultivar Louise I mean look at that it grew two new leaves and oh my god I'm so happy because look at that beautiful pattern on the leaves as well can, can, cannot wait to see the flowers because they say they have like bluish flowers and I cannot wait for that this is another beautiful, beautiful succulent and it's very chubby as well. And the name is quite... Uh, uh, quite long. Pacifit, uh, pa, pacifitum oviferum. I absolutely love, 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 love the uh, chubby leaves very beautiful another hoya that is growing and i'm so happy about it this is my hoya obovata i mean the main leaves as you can see they are a little bit um, lighter in color but it grew so much it grew two new leaves it grew that one that one and this one as well I look look this one how beautiful and round and as you can see it gives me peduncles as well so i can wait for this one to flower if he wants to flower this year beautiful beautiful uh, hoya to have in your collection another one that gives me beautiful leaves and a little bit stress uh, sun stress sorry hoya carnosa freckles i mean look at that i mean they don't really have uh, speckles but look at this one because look at the two main leaves on the hoya they are quite speckly but look, look at the new one, how beautiful it is. And I can see they have new growth as well, which is absolutely stunning. Another one that, oh my God, it grows and I'm so happy about it. This is my Hoya Chelsea. I mean, look at that beautiful new growth. Oh my God, I love this Hoya. I hope one day to have a big full uh, pot of this Hoya Chelsea. Absolutely stunning. In uh, here in the UK, it's not easy to buy a full uh, pot of Hoya Chelsea. I haven't seen uh, this Hoya uh, in in the UK, to be honest with you. I bought some cuttings online, and as you can see, they are growing, and I'm so happy, and I think I'm going to propagate and propagate and propagate until I will have a full um, pot of this beautiful Hoya. Another one that is absolutely gorgeous, this is my Hoya previously aubergine and it grew for me two new leaves i mean look at that how beautiful they are i absolutely love 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 this hoya beautiful beautiful hoya and as you can see the tendril is still growing very very beautiful another one that it's still growing and look at that beautiful beautiful variegation this is my hoya latifolia variegated I mean, look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? It's absolutely beautiful. I absolutely love, love, love new growth. Very beautiful. The variegation on that is going to be amazing. Another one that is growing and I'm so happy. This is my Hoya Gunungading. I mean, look at that. Very slow, but it's growing and I'm so happy about it. Gorgeous, gorgeous pattern on the leaves. Very beautiful. Oh, the other one that is start to grow and I propagate from the mother plant. This is Hoya Carnosa 
gray ghost. I mean, look at those roots and it's growing. So happy about it. I love, 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 love silver leaves. They are so beautiful, very, very beautiful. I mean, I was so surprised to see a peduncle. Can you see the buds? I can't wait for this Hoya to flower for me. This is my Hoya Hushkeliana uh, variegated. I mean, I have this Hoya for a long, long, long time. And it grew and look, it's going to flower for me. So happy that this one is going to flower for me. So this year, the, my Hoyas, they are still growing and I'm so happy about it. I have this beautiful, beautiful basket of Hoya Sigillates. I absolutely love Hoya Sigillates. I mean, look at those two leaves, sun stress, very beautiful. And look at the tendrils and look at the new growth as well. I hope maybe this Hoya is going to flower for me this year. Who knows? We're gonna wait and see. Another beautiful, beautiful new growth. Look at that beautiful Hoya Keria variegated. I mean, oh my God, this Hoya has been in my care for a couple of years. Didn't grow, but look at her now. So happy. And this one as well, oh my God, this one surprised me this year. This, there are two new leaves, another two pair of leaves. I mean, this is my Hoya Keria inner variegated. I mean, I absolutely love, look at that beautiful, beautiful inner variegation. Very, very beautiful, very gorgeous. So happy when I see my Hoyas uh, growing. Even this Hoya carry ice splash as well. I mean, the tendril, it's really, 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 really big. And it surprised me with a peduncle. And I can't wait for this Hoya to flower. Can you see how beautiful the peduncle is? And you can see the small buds, they will develop in big buds and then it's gonna flower as well. I mean, I absolutely loving it, loving it, loving it. I cannot wait for this Hoya uh, Polyneura variegated to grow for me. I just uh, place it in pond because I didn't see any sign of growth and maybe it's going to give me new leaves. Another one that is growing and it's absolutely gorgeous and beautiful. This is my Hoya species, uh, Flores Island. Very gorgeous, absolutely beautiful. And uh, I have two beautiful new leaves. I mean, look at that. And another two as well. Very, very gorgeous. This is my Hoya. Beautiful, beautiful Hoya. Oh my God, Archeo Baldiana. I mean, look at those roots. I have to, uh, to water this Hoya. I mean, beautiful, beautiful Hoya to have in my collection. I absolutely love, love, love this Hoya. I mean, this Hoya, it's new, to be honest with you, but I'm so happy that it tendrilling out and look at those two beautiful new growth as well. Very gorgeous. I'm gonna leave it here for now because I need to water this beautiful, beautiful uh, Hoya. And I can see some mealybugs, so I have to spray the Hoya for mealybugs as well. I have a special, I have a special uh, spray and I will show you, I will show you the spray for mealybugs. I mean, this is absolutely, I love, love, love this uh, um, formula. This is plant invigorate, invigorator and bug killer. I mean, you mix it with water and oh my god it's absolutely it's a very very good as you can see it's a pesticide and growth uh, stimulant i love 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 this uh, this uh, product very 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 uh, good product you can see ideal for orchids and house plants i always always mix with water and put in a bottle and uh, spray the plant and i don't have any problems whatsoever very, very good product. Another beautiful Hoya that is growing and I'm so happy about it. This is my Hoya Calistophila. I mean, look at that growth. I mean, isn't this Hoya gorgeous? 
I mean, I bought it with two leaves and look at her. She gave me four, one, two, three, four, and still growing and is in moss. I don't know why, but my Hoyas, they are thriving in moss. Absolutely thriving and I'm so happy about it. Another one that is growing, look at that beautiful sun stress uh, leaf. This is my Hoya Thompsonii, very, very beautiful. I mean, I have so many Hoya Thompsonii. Uh, look at that beautiful new leaf, very, very gorgeous. I'm so happy when my Hoyas are growing. I know I'm still repeating myself, but I don't really care. Hoya Silver Dollar, I mean, look at the two new leaf absolutely gorgeous and they are sun stress as well and it's still growing and I'm so happy so happy when I bought this Hoya just one leaf and when you see that they are growing oh makes you more and more happy as well because you know those Hoyas these Hoyas they are not really that cheap and I went there I don't I want them to do well another one that is absolutely gorgeous and is growing and it's still growing and growing and thriving this is my Hoya Hippolasia. As you can see, the pot, it's very, very small, but I don't really, doesn't bother me. When Hoya is happy, I am happy. Look at those two new pair of leaves, and you can see it's tendrilling out and it's still growing. So happy. Very, very beautiful. My Hoya amicabiles, you can see the flowers, they are still on, and for sure, you can see they drop a few of them and that's it. It's uh, the end of them. Look at how beautiful, very gorgeous. Can you see how beautiful and yellow they are? Very, very gorgeous. I absolutely enjoy these uh, flowers. Absolutely beautiful. Another Hoya that is absolutely gorgeous. This is Hoya, a heart-shaped leaf and it's growing. And I'm so happy that it's growing. Give me new pair of leaves and even this Hoya Kamijiana variegated. New pair of leaves, which makes me happy to see. Another one, this is Hoya Panchoi. Beautiful, beautiful new pair of leaves. This Hoya Serpents is growing very, very beautifully, growing very, very nice. And this is Hoya, let me see, Onicoides and it gave me a new fresh leaf i mean look at that it's still a little bit wonky but i hope it's going to grow bigger very beautiful i never thought that this way is going to grow for me and look at that another one that is absolutely gorgeous and i'm so happy that it's still carrying on growing this is my beautiful hoya mini bell splash i mean look at that and look at the new leaves absolutely gorgeous love 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 this hoya very beautiful hoya i love love the elongated leaves very gorgeous mm. another one surprised me and i was so happy this is my hoya meridithiae affinity meridithiae I mean, surprise me with two new pair of leaves. Look how beautiful they are. I mean, they are so cute. Love, 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 love this beautiful, beautiful Hoya. My Clemenciorum is starting to grow. Very slow grower, very, very slow grower. You can see the tendril, and I hope I can see uh, leaves very soon. Another slow grower. This is my Hoya Asula Wesiana. I mean, you can see it's uh, it's growing, but very, very slow. I want to see beautiful, beautiful, uh, fresh pair of leaves. What is wrong with this one? This is another Hoya that I absolutely love. This is my Nic Hoya Nicols Nicolsonia New Guinea Ghost. I mean, look at that, sun stress. I don't know what is wrong with that uh, leaf, but look at those two new pair of leaves very beautiful absolutely love it. love 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 this hoya i have two uh, cuttings in just one uh, pot i mean look at that isn't that gorgeous it's absolutely beautiful very very beautiful and i absolutely loving it 
I don't know, this one is too much sun, maybe. Okay, let her grow. Another one that is growing and growing and growing and growing. And I want her to flower, but I do not see flowers. This is my Hoya Zambales. I don't know if you can see the name. I mean, look at that. I mean, absolutely gorgeous. The new uh, fresh pair of leaves. But I do not see, I want to see a peduncle and I want to see flowers. Very beautiful. Oh, my Hoya Carnosa Nova Ghost is still waiting to, I don't know, give me a sign of growth. I don't really mind. And, of course, Hoya Motoske. Hoya Motoske, it gave me two new pair of fresh leaves. Look at that. And it still carry on. I don't know if you can see carry on tenderly up and give me another two pair two uh, fresh uh, pair of leaves so beautiful I'm absolutely enjoy this uh, greenhouse I will show you quickly another beautiful plant that I have in my collection I don't know if it's a pistia, but it's very beautiful and velvety. I mean, look at that uh, beautiful, beautiful uh, flower. A friend of mine, she had this uh, beautiful, beautiful plant and I took a cutting of it. Look how beautiful it is. I mean, it's so fuzzy. Absolutely love, love, love the leaves. And look at the flowers. Absolutely gorgeous. They look like lipstick uh, flowers. I absolutely love in it. I love in it for the flowers. I mean, look how beautiful and red the flower is. My beautiful Hoya Thompsoniae. Look how cute the new uh, two pair of uh, fresh leaves are. Very, very beautiful. Hoya Philansoniae. Look at two beautiful uh, fresh pair of leaves. I have this uh, Hoya Bertonia cuttings and I just place it in a um, in a container. I mean, they are so beautiful. I love them. I really, really love them. I hope they are going to grow for me. Very beautiful. My beautiful Hoya Matilde uh, variegated, I mean, it's growing and growing and growing and absolutely loving it. I love the variegation. Absolutely beautiful, beautiful. Um, this is my Hoya Australis and you can see it just gave me a tendril and I hope it's going to grow uh, leaves. Well, I have so many beautiful Hoyas and they are growing. This is my Hoya. This is beautiful as well. I absolutely love it. This is Hoya Lithophytica. I love, I have spiders in this greenhouse and you know, spiders, they eat a lot of uh, mealybugs. So I love them. I love a small leaf Hoya. Look how beautiful this Hoya is. Very, very gorgeous. Um, I don't know if you watch my latest uh, video that uh, I reach 500 subscribers and I'm so happy about it and I'm all over the moon happy. I hope you carry on subscribing and liking my uh, YouTube uh, videos and my YouTube channel Adina Kikero Plants equals happiness. And I have a winner. So the lucky winner who answer uh, at my uh, question that I ask, uh, who is your favorite Hoya? She is Selina Mafumo. And Selina, she's gonna receive this beautiful, beautiful cutting of Hoya Carnosa Nova Ghost. I'm gonna send it through post and I hope she's gonna enjoy it. I mean, it's rooted. And as you can see, I place it in sphagnum moss and I'm so happy for her. I think uh, you, 
you are always happy when you you uh, win something so i hope you enjoy this hoya selena oh thank you so much for subscribing and i hope you carry on subscribing because i want to reach a thousand this is another hoya that is absolutely beautiful and i absolutely love in it this is my hoya ruthie oh my god the leaves the flowers on this ruthie it's absolutely gorgeous and it's growing absolutely i absolutely love the new growth can you see how beautiful the leaves are and new growth as well very very beautiful enjoy this hoya so much um another one that is growing i think i show it to you and look it i mean this hoya surprised me this year this is hoya acuta variegated hendersoniae with so much growth oh my god this hoya grew so much and it's carry on growing as you can see the tendril it's just really absolutely bonkers i absolutely loving it and it's carry on give me new leaves very very beautiful hoya very gorgeous well that's it really i hope you enjoy this video i mean everything in my greenhouse is growing I have this beautiful, beautiful uh, Hoya uh, Bella variegated, which gives me new pair of leaves, and I'm so happy about it. I mean, it g really, really loves the greenhouse environment. And this beautiful, beautiful Hoya Codata as well. I have uh, many cuttings in this uh, pot. But look at those two new pair of leaves, which, of course, they are sun stress as well. Another surprise that I was really happy to see, because to be honest with you, it's a very, very slow grower. And oh my God, this is my um, um, Anturium clarinervum. Look at the new uh, pair of uh, leaf. Very happy that I see gro uh, growth on this uh, Anturium because it's such a slow grower as well. This is another beautiful, beautiful plant. This is Maranta Kerchoviana variegated. Can you see the bloom? Means that uh, she's happy if she gave me a bloom. So everything in this gro greenhouse growing, happy. This is another beautiful, beautiful uh, plant. This is my Philodendron painted lady. I mean, look at the new pair of leaf very very beautiful i cannot wait for this uh, big uh, hoya i think it's dinner plate uh, hoya to grow didn't see any growth maybe i don't know later in august because we're still in uh, in july so i hope it's going to grow and give me new pair of uh, fresh leaves so that's it I mean, they are growing, they are happy, and they make me so happy as well because they are growing. I hope you enjoy this uh, video. Please, can you subscribe and like my videos? My channel, it's all about uh, Hoyas, that are my number one passion. Houseplants, Comoro Rare, S uh, Cactus, uh, Succulents, uh, uh, Planters and Pots. So thank you very much for subscribing. Please carry on subscribe because I want to reach a thousand, a thousand uh, subscribers, a thousand pounds. <laughs> and um, see you in my next video. All the best. Bye.